I'd now like to give the floor to the International Service for Human Rights, please. Thank you, Mr. President. ISHR is deeply concerned at the worsening incidents of enforced disappearance and other attacks against human rights defenders advocating in relation to land grabbing, corporate accountability, indigenous rights, labor rights, and other economic, social, and cultural rights issues, particularly those advocating or protesting against major business projects and investments. In that regard, we would be interested in hearing the working group's reflections on the role that business could play in speaking out against enforced disappearance of human rights defenders, even where the defenders' work is related to their own operations. As outlined by the working group, enforced disappearances are increasingly used not only to punish protest and dissent, but also to intimidate and deter others. By way of example, the case of Lao defender Sombat Somfon, who has been missing for more than 1,000 days, illustrates this clearly. In China, the enforced disappearance and ultimate death of Chinese human rights lawyer and housing rights activist Zhao Xunli, notwithstanding claims by the delegation this last Monday that Ms. Zhao was, quote, not a human rights defender, end quote, was intended to both silence her and send a chilling message to others. The more recent enforced disappearances of arbit and arbitrary detention of Chinese economic, social and cultural rights defenders such as Mi Chong Biao and Su Chang Lan send a similar message. The working group also rightly condemns the increased labelling of ESCR rights activists as, lab as rebel inser rebels, insurgents, terrorists or as being against development and the use of such terms to justify, condone or minimise human rights violations committed against them. In that light, the Council should demand that states ensure that high-level of government officials publicly recognize the vital and legitimate role of defenders in promoting ESCR rights and sustainable development and enact specific laws and policies to protect them. Thank you.